Hello, this is Eric Waltz Capital, and I've got to ask you the big money question. This is something that most people don't think about, but I'm going to throw it your way. And this may not pertain to you. If you got $100,000 liquid put aside for a medical emergency, even with your best insurance through work or on your own coverage, swipe left, click off, do whatever is necessary. But if not, keep listening. The purpose for this video is to educate and inform the public that you can actually use hybrid life insurance policies to survive and live on and to create an umbrella plan for your healthcare plan. Sounds kind of odd, sounds different, fine, whatever. Let me give you an example. We all hear about you know saving for the unexpected emergencies like fixing the roof, things like that, even with, you know, homeowners, whatever it may be. But what about a medical emergency? You know, health insurance is there, great. But the bigger question is, is money, deductibles, out of pocket, you're not working. Even if you have disability insurance, thumbs up to you. But the bottom line is everyone needs a slush fund. So again, if you got a hundred thousand quarter million dollars set aside for a medical emergency, with great insurance, you don't need to talk to me. You don't need to listen to this video. But quite frankly, I think you, just like myself and most people included, need to have something in place. Living benefits are a secret in the life insurance industry that pays people to survive, such as from a critical illness like heart attack, cancer, um, stroke, things of those nature, also to a major disability, whether if it's for long-term care or just you can't take care of yourself because you fell down the stairs and broke your leg and you can't work for a couple months. Things like that in nature. Bottom line is, I can give you an example. For example, uh, saying it like this twice. Borrow? No. Take away your death benefit? Not necessarily. But what it will do is it's paying you to live. What I mean by the death benefit, let's say you have a $100,000 death benefit term policy, whether it's 10, 15, 30 year term, or an index universal life policy, which is for the rest of your life. You can tap into the death benefit. For example, pull out 90% of some of those plans that pays you tax free to survive, let's say cancer. That's 90 grand. Let's say if you had a million dollar life insurance policy that was a hybrid living benefit policy, that's 900,000. Those are just ideas. Even with disability, you can draw down some of them I've seen 25% of the benefit. So you're talking about anywhere from $25,000 a year all the way to a quarter of a million dollars a year to live and to survive on your income outside of health insurance covering the medical bills. I don't wanna bore you, I don't wanna chase you away, but go, hey, click on the link below, take some ideas of what the quotes could be for anyone in a great range to look at it. Quite frankly, life insurance is out there for you to live. Check us out. This is Eric at waltzcapital.com. Check out our website. Check out the extra links that I have on this video on how you can educate yourself on how living benefits can change the game in the life insurance industry for your favor. Talk soon.